Hello everyone. Welcome to the study of economics. This particular video is about the bridge codes. All the fields of study are important in our daily life. For example, physics we are applying in our daily life by the way of using the mobile phones, electronics and electricity. Like that, economics also we can use in our everyday life. But we cannot bother about the language of economics. Thus, when we think like an economist, we came to know about the use of economics in our daily basis. For example, buying and selling goods, dealing with money, dealing with bank, educational institutions, hospitals, like everywhere, every individuals directly or indirectly dealing with economics. Thus, in this course, first we know about the different terms used in economics. Then students, now let me see what are the common terms used in economics in our daily life. That is goods and services. Then what is goods and services? Using of various things in our daily life is called goods and services. For example, clothes, food, book, bicycle, phone, TV, etc. So these are all goods. But the nature between the goods and services are different. Goods are the physical and tangible objects. That means goods we can see, we can touch, we can smell and feel it. But what about services? Services are intangible things. That means we cannot touch, we cannot smell, we cannot see but we can feel it. The major common services are electricity, transportation, education, medical care, tailoring, music, mobile and internet services. In this way, these are the two common terms used in our daily life. Next, we will discuss about other terms used in economics. Consumers, producers and distributors. Then, who are consumers, who are producers and who are distributors? A consumer is one who buys goods for his own consumption or people using goods and services are called consumer. For example, if I purchase a new TV, mobile phone, car, clothes, food, now I am the consumer. Why I am consumer? Because I purchase that particular product to satisfy my want. Thus, consumers plays a vital role in the economy by satisfying his wants. Next, producers. Producers are those who engaged in the production of goods and services. Or, producers make the goods and services that are sold in the economy. The best example for producers are business firms. Next, distributor. Then, who are distributors? Distributors are those who made available all the goods and services produced by the producers at our place by the way of transporters, traders and shopkeepers. So they are called as distributors. Thus, consumers, producers and distributors 
these three are also a link with the market so this also we use in our daily life